Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I do unboxings here. Mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, even a dash of Disney. So if you like unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And as always, if you are already subscribed, thank you so much for being here and welcome back. Thank you especially for all of your positive words in the comments here on videos and the community tab and over on Instagram. Those words are really what keep me motivated when I'm feeling a little bit disturbed discouraged by YouTube or just a little overwhelmed trying to balance YouTube and my other jobs. So I do really appreciate all of your continued support, you guys. Shout out to all of you awesome subscribers. Today though, I have my October Brownstone and Main Box. This is a lifestyle subscription and it's great because it is bi-monthly and it features small businesses that are owned by women. So lots of good things already. You guys know that I love bi-monthly subscriptions. One, because it cuts down on your monthly costs, but also because it allows you to really use and enjoy the products that are inside of those bi-monthly boxes. Brownstone and Main is $44.99 per box. That does include free shipping here in the US. If you're interested in getting it, this October box is already sold out, so you would be signing up for their December box, which I got the December box last year and it was fantastic. You can also use the code NOEL10 to save 10%, so I'll leave all that information for you guys in the description box below. Now the box is just a plain white box with some branded tape, so I totally understand that they're saving on their packaging, that's fine. Um, inside, let's see what it looks like. So pretty cute, we've just got some white tissue paper and a little red heart sticker keeping everything together. So let me open it up and see. They do a really nice product pamphlet that tells us a lot about those women-owned businesses. I won't necessarily read all of that information to you, just kind of the pertinent information about each of the items as we go through. It looks like she did include the retail values, which you guys know that I love because I feel like it frees me to enjoy the curation a little bit more, which does really go into the overall value, not just cost and price of the box in my mind. So it looks like we got one, two, three, four, five, six items, maybe, maybe seven. So that's pretty good. I'm very excited to see. It says fall is in the air, October box. That's the theme. All right, so I'll just have to kind of hunt around and figure out what's coming from each of these. So non-toxic nails never look this good, so I'm guessing it has to do with one of the products in there, so we'll get to that later. And then I'm just seeing some foozles that I'm gonna get out of the way. Um, maybe I can go like in order with the pamphlet just so we can kind of narrow things down. So uh, it looks like we are getting a jewelry item, the Empower Bracelet. So let me see if I can find that. Um, maybe this maybe this method is not the way to go but we'll give it a try so here we go we found the empower bracelet it's actually really pretty it's like a multi strand little beaded bracelet so it says this bracelet is handmade by women artisans in India it also provides funds for women's education and empowerment projects and it has a retail value of $24 so that's already like half the value of the box but of course what's nice about it is that it has a good cause and this is uh, brought to us from Kelly from World Finds is the company but look how pretty you guys I really like that I actually like the color red so that's not too bold for me but I would like those like thinner strands as well with the little sparkles so that's really cute I think it's just like an elastic bracelet I'm they actually look like they're all separate too so you wouldn't necessarily have to wear the red strand if that just seems a little bit too bright for you but that's really pretty and I'll definitely take some pictures of it over on Instagram for you all right so that is lovely let's see what else we've got the next thing I'm seeing well <laughs> this is good I didn't want to say it until I knew that there was there was something in here now you guys have probably heard me say it several times now that I feel like you can't have a good fall box without having a fall candle and we do indeed have a candle and it's beautiful oh I am excited about this this is coconut and apricot wax it's from Tidal Living and the scent is a mold cider it's hand poured in Freeport Maine but look how pretty this tin is you guys it's kind of like almost a rose gold so pretty so sleek and I'm excited that it's a mold cider. We've been getting a lot of, you know, pumpkin spice and that kind of thing. But I like, mmm, 
Oh, that's really, really nice. I love when it's got that like apple scent to kind of, you know, cut the super sweet scents that we get a lot in fall boxes. And it's a wood wick, which I used to not be a big fan of wood wicks, but you guys have convinced me that it is nice to hear that extra crackle. And of course they do burn a lot cleaner. So, ooh, this is a really nice one. I am very happy to have that. So this candle is so good it says I've been burning it non-stop since I received mine enjoy your home smelling like fall it has a retail value of $12 and this comes from Christine from Tidal Living so very cool really nice candle all right let's see what else we've got Ooh, we've got an eyelash and eyebrow growth serum let me see if I can find that in here so this is kind of fun. We've got like more um, beauty products than I've seen before in this box. So here it is, came in a nice, nice sleek box, just getting some of that foozle dust off of it. So this comes from Pickles Potions. That's a cute name for a company. It says this serum will bring your lashes and your brows to the next level. Use at night before you go to bed. So you guys know that I have eyelash extensions most of the time. I usually like wait three weeks in between getting them filled. So there are so definitely times when I'm going pretty much with just mascara. I'm trying to get this box open. I always have trouble with these boxes without um, tearing the tab. So if you ever win a giveaway from me, you guys, and you get some items and the boxes just look like they've been tampered with, they probably have because I probably had to rip them open. So let me see. I'm still trying to get this one open. It says that this has a retail value of $16. I actually just ripped the tab off just so that we could see it. All right, so I'm gonna uh, go ahead and tape that back up because, well, maybe I'll hold on to it because I, I have like non-existent eyelashes. Some of that is from doing the eyelash extensions and some of that is just like, that's hereditary. I just don't have very thick lashes. So it's interesting because it's like, it's like yellow colored, I think. I think that's like a clear, container but that's interesting i've definitely used lash serums before and felt like they maybe helped but i could definitely use it on my brows because my brows are also very thin so that's really cool and um like i said 16 dollars. it's 10 milliliters it's handcrafted in maine um and i love like small batch stuff like that so that's really cool i'll have to read what the actual ingredients are and she even has an etsy shop but what a like professional looking uh box that was totally uh child proof and noel proof because i I had to rip it apart to get into it all right let's see what else we've got we got a cuticle serum so i did go past that as i was digging in there and this cuticle serum is from funke from huge shop so let's see it says this is worth eight dollars we're getting great uh values in this box so it's just a little one Herbal nail and cuticle oil. It says directions, apply and massage oil to cuticle and nail bed for best results. Apply morning and night before bed. I'm wondering if it's got like a little brush or, so it's just a little like roller ball. So that's interesting, but easy to apply. I was worried that it was like just a uh, empty uh, top so that it, you'd have to, you know, apply it with something or it could get really messy. It says this serum is perfect for the fall and winter seasons. Use before going to bed for the best results. And it says again that it was worth $8. So I love that. That's very cool. And again, it's so nice, you guys, that she includes little like bios and pictures of all of the women that are contributing to this box. All right, next we have got something from Maria, Miriam, and Paula from Seven True. And this is what that little card had to do with. We got a fall nail polish and it's all stuck with foozles and some bubble wrap, which it's good that they wrapped it up. A little extra care. It says, this fall inspired nail polish is a muted lavender inspired by the understated purple and violet accents of the season. And it says this is worth $15 and it is very pretty. Um, I like it because it's a little bit of a darker lavender. I was worried that it was gonna be super light. It's almost like, it's a lot of, there's a lot of pink in there, but it's still got enough purple in it that it's something that I would wear. So I could see this looking lovely fingers or toes. And it could definitely carry you right into spring. So nice color. Awesome. So I love that. And I love, again, that it's a smaller, smaller company and it says it's non-toxic, vegan, and cruelty-free. So very cool. We've been getting a lot of great nail polish colors in subscription boxes. And I always feel like that's like what, a thing that I'd like want to pick out myself. But they've been doing really, really well. Okay. And then we still have more things. Awesome. 
So the next thing I am seeing is some tea, which if you've been watching my channel for any time, you know that I have an abundance of tea. I have a very full tea cabinet, but it is fall and then winter comes next, right? So I'll definitely be able to finally dive into some of the tea that I have been saving. I also love to re-gift tea and exciting blends, so it's a great thing to have an abundance of. I don't mind. But this is some pumpkin spice loose leaf herbal tea from And That's The Tea Company. So here is their little package. And then I also love when you get to see what the tea looks like on the back. So you can see like, you know, what kind of tea strainer or infuser you need to use because sometimes it's like really chunky and sometimes it's really fine like this is a really fine loose leaf tea that you'd need something with like a very thin or a very small mesh you couldn't just use something that has like big holes in it so it says that this pumpkin spice loose leaf tea is five dollars and then what's great is they gave us like I was just talking about a little tea infuser and I love these little ball ones that just um, have like a wire mesh and then you snap them closed and then they have like a little chain so they really do just work like a tea bag they're super easy to use and that is what helps me in terms of getting through some of that loose leaf tea is if it's super easy to use and it says that's worth three dollars so again I do love that they included that if you're not someone like me who gets a ton of loose leaf tea and subscription boxes it's nice that they go went ahead and gave you something so that's like you know plug and play you don't have to go out and buy something else to get to try the tea so very very nice and then finally we got something from and that was from Jenny and Kylie for that was that and that's the tea company and then we got something from Candice from Appeal Cosmetics and it's an eyeshadow palette so nice assortment lots of categories in this lifestyle box this month and it is worth $21 and this is gorgeous it says Illuminati quad palette look at the colors you guys that is so so pretty totally colors that I would use especially those deeper ones on the bottom, but these ones at the top look like they'd be great for like highlighting and just like the inner eye and stuff. Wow, really, really pretty. And I like smaller palettes. I'm not into the super big ones because I find them kind of overwhelming. And you guys know that I don't wear a ton of makeup except for these videos. All right, so it says this is worth $21. This eyeshadow palette will make your eyes pop this fall season. And the great thing about this eyeshadow palette is that it works with all skin tones and you can wear it during the day for work or while out on the town. So haven't been doing much out on the town town stuff but definitely during the day these are great shades to kind of give your eyes a little bit more attention or get your eyes a little bit more attention and I do feel like I've been doing more eye makeup because I used to just do like a lipstick but obviously we're all still wearing face masks when we go out and about so you want to draw a little more attention to your beautiful eyes so again I thought this was a great great box from Brownstone and Maine probably my favorite one from them so far just because of the assortment of items but also the number of items and their values so we got again our empower bracelet which is supporting women's education and empowerment projects in India very lovely we got our fall candle in that mold cider scent which smells amazing we got the eyelash and eyebrow growth serum we got our cuticle serum as well, so lots of uh, good self-care items. We got the beautiful uh, nail polish as well as that palette. And then we got the loose leaf tea with the tea strainer. So really, really nice box. Again, let me know what your favorite item was in the comments below. I think my favorite item is actually, well, the candle but then probably the eyeshadow palette honestly which is kind of a surprise and something new for me if you enjoyed this video you guys please do give it a thumbs up to help my channel out and hopefully i see you all very very soon in my next unboxing